Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Puppy Floppy. You guys know the drill. We play horror games, and today we're playing a little horror game called Bonnie's Bakery. Yes. It is a horror game. I don't know about y'all, but I don't trust any of this shit that's going on in the screen right now. The bright colors, the cute little kid. I don't trust none of that shit. If you watch any of my videos, shit hits the fan fast. Okay, this Bonnie's Bakery is going to be Bonnie's soul-sucking extravaganza at some point. And I'm here for it. Hopefully you guys are here for it. Hopefully it's entertaining. Maybe we even get a few laughs out of it. I don't know. But before we dive in, get the YouTube stuff out the way. I'm trying to reach a thousand subscribers. If you guys can help me with that, that'd be amazing. If you can't, that's fine too. I just hope you enjoy the content. And hey, maybe this is a video that gets you to press the big red button and join the dark side. So let's dive in. Bonnie's Bakery. Not going to take any more of your time. Let's see what this game is about. Tutorial. <laughs> I don't need no tutorial. Yeah, I should probably do the tutorial. Nah, nah. Yeah, nah. Nah, fuck it. Start fresh. Bonnie sweeps the floor and dusts the windows. Today is going to be another big day. Customers are already making a line outside of her bakery. Do I need to click? Okay. Oh, Jesus. She opens the door and they all scamper in. She looks at the crowd with a warm smile. A regular customer pops out of the crowd and gives Bonnie a friendly pat on the back. Hold on. Let me, uh... Hey, Bonnie, old friend. I have an, I have an uh, event coming up. And I'd like to bake one of your famous red velvet cakes. I wouldn't, you wouldn't mind sharing the recipe with me, with little old me now, would you? Uh, trying to steal my recipe, bear? <laughs> Tee -hee. Oh, bear, you're so silly. A master chef never reveals her secret recipe. My boy Bonnie, or girl, whatever, you know what I mean. Don't give out your recipes. The two laugh heartily, heartily. <laughs> Alrighty then, I'll stop bothering you. I'll trust that bear. It's like there, bear sits down with the rest of the customers. All right. Phew, looks like it's time to get baking. Okay. Welcome to Bonnie's Bakery. Help Bonnie serve her hungry customers by serving up some tasty pastries. Now I've played Overcooked and it did not go over well. So I expect. Oh, I see Bear has already sat down. Hmm. Let's see what he wants today. Okay. Oh, red velvet cake. What a good choice. All right. Alrighty, let's start baking then. I should click on the prep station to bring it up. The preps this? All right. Alrighty, baking time. Um. Oh dear, how do I make red velvet cake again? I should check my recipe book. This. Red velvet cake. Put these items into our stand mixer. Flour, sugar, milk, eggs, fat, and bread. <laughs> Pour the batter into the cake tin. Bake it in the oven. Done. Okay. Um. Okay. I should start, dra start by dragging the ingredients into the stand mixer. Okay, so flour, sugar, milk, eggs, flour, sugar, milk, eggs, fat, red. Next. Great. Now, now to mix it. Mix. Now. now to pour it into the cake tin. Okay, and now we bake it. Okay. Click on click on Baron and hand this over. Alright. Yay, another customer well served. Um It's a good thing Bear is the first customer so I can serve him first. I have a lot of customers run out of patience. Oh. Huh. Okay. Well, the day's just getting started. Time to really get to work. See you later, Bear. Oh. Oh, I could probably make some other things while I'm waiting for customers. Um. Let's see. I could just drop what I make on one of those plates and save it for later. Okay. Okay. I guess I'll just make something random for now. Off to the prep station. Okay. Make something random? The hell, Bobby? Random? Uh, let's see. 
Let's try white donuts. Flour, sugar, milk, eggs, and fat. Flour, sugar, milk, eggs, and fat. Uh, and mixer. Put the dough on the cutting board. Roll out the dough. Okay. Sleep like that, and then roll it out. Roll out the dough, cut the dough with the circle cutter, bake it in the oven. Okay, put it in the oven, and then put some white on it. Boom! I'm a fucking chef, Mike. Oh gosh, that was quick. What do you want? Uh, ah, they want a meat okay. bun. I'll go make that now. Okay. Meat bun. Okay, put these items in the stand mixer. Flour, milk, eggs. Flour, milk, eggs. Mix. Uh, bring some meat to the cutting board. Chop the meats. <laughs> like a uh, bang. Okay, chop the meats. Bring the dough to the cutting board and bake it in the oven. Okay. Boom. 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 You've All been right. served, sucker. All right, let's keep this up. What do you want? What the fuck is this? What the hell is that? Uh, oh, pastry. Put these mint flour, sugar, fat. Okay. Flour, sugar, fat. Uh, put the dough on the cutting board, roll out the pastry, put fat on it. Put fat on it. Bake it in the oven. All right, and then we're good. Okay. Been served. Oh, what did he want? A donut? Oh, right there. I got you. I got you, big dog. There you go. Oh, he wants the meat thing. Okay. Um. What, how do I make it? Flour, milk, eggs. Flour, milk, eggs. I don't have eggs. Oh, wait. Milk. I'm asleep. I just put in eggs. Uh, don't pay attention to me. Oh, wait. Uh, oh, we gotta put the meat. Fuck. Okay. And then. Oh, no. I clicked off the screen. And then put this in the oven. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Got you. This ain't so bad. Gordon ain't got Let's shit on me. Here comes the lunch rush. Time to get serious. Oh, oh shit. Uh, come on, come on, baby. Come on, serve that motherfucker, boy. Shit, all oh, this sucks ass. Uh, fat, red, milk, egg mix. Oh, he, no, 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 come on, come on, come on. I gotta do the meat, I gotta do the meat. Um, uh, flour, milk, eggs, flour, milk, eggs, flour, mm, milk, eggs, mix, uh, meat, chop, bang, bang. Come on, come on, baby. No! Oh, fuck. Phew, all done. Ah, rough day, huh? That's okay. We all make mistakes sometimes. Hey, on the plus side, you can save on the ingredient cost. Ha uh ha. -huh. Fuck you, bear. I guess I'm still getting the hang of things. I'm glad you opened the bakery. It's nice to have a place to relax and take my mind off things. I never, never, I never knew we lived in such a dangerous neighborhood. It's so scary. People are disappearing without a trace, almost as if they've been erased. 
It's definitely been scary. Stay safe out there, bear. And fuck that bear. You too, Bonnie. See you around. Bye-bye. Of course. Bear leaves and Bonnie cleans up the bakery. Now then. Now then. It's been a busy day. <laughs> Time to get some fresh ingredients. Guys, I'm nervous. I just want everybody to know that. I'm... Ah! What in the fuck is this? Bruh, is that body? Yo. What, what is going on? What is going on? Yo. The fuck am I doing? Do I need to stay away from her? Yo, buddy, it's fucking crazy! What the fuck? What is going on? <laughs> what the fuck? Yo! What am I supposed to do? What am I? Oh, well, bu bu no, Bonnie, 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 relax, 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 relax. What am I supposed to do? I am so confused. Oh. Oh, no, 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 relax. Bonnie, 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 no, no, no. Oh, she's coming back, bro. Am I being chased? Oh shit, no, no, no. Relax, relax. Ah! Oh shit. What is she doing? Why does she want my booty hole? Am I gonna be her next pastry? Ah! Oh no! Bonnie, relax. No, 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 relax. You just gotta relax. Oh, I'm just getting close. <laughs> oh, shit. Burn. Bonnie sweeps the floor and dusts the windows. Today is going to be another big day. Customers are already making a line outside for of her bakery. She opens the door and they all scamper in. She looks at the crowd with a warm smile. Regular customer pops out of the crowd and gives Bonnie a friendly pat on the back. Hey Bonnie, old friend, since you can't really give me the recipe to your cake, how about you make one for me to take home? A cake for you to take home? I never thought about doing takeouts before. That sounds like a good idea. Yes, Bear, I'll bake you a red velvet cake to take home. <laughs> And you know what? Since you're my number one customer, I'll use my freshest ingredients to make that cake. Bonnie's a goddamn murderer. I knew it! I told y'all! I told y'all! Ending 105. Fresh ingredients. Oh, shit. Okay. Try to read it from here. Uh, I was nervous there. First day I opened the bakery was the happiest day of my life. I was nervous that there wouldn't be any customers, but nine people came in to eat. It looked like they didn't enjoy what I made, but maybe that's just nerves talking. Yeah, it's just nerves. Okay, so nine. It's been two weeks since I opened the bakery. Uh, I had to restock the pantry with the eggs today. I bought a whole crate for just $8. What a steal. Sadly, no one came in to eat. I guess the townsfolk don't really like my pastries. Oh, shit. He's right here. Okay. Three. Three weeks and not a single customer. I'm going to have to close down at this rate. No one is interested in my cooking. So why would I even bother? Someone knocked on the door. It was a bunny with three terrible injuries. I let her stay inside my bakery to rest. Okay. Week four of having the bakery and things aren't getting better. That poor bunny, I spent two hours trying to heal the injuries. But it's only getting worse. She keeps getting more and more anxious 
I'm trying my best, but it's not enough. I hope she can get better soon. I'm going to keep trying. It's been five weeks now. I decided to open the bakery after the customer walked into my shop and asked what that wonderful smell was. The only things I prepared today were the buns. He called in nine other friends to eat at my bakery. They, they enjoyed the buns so much he said that he'll tell more people about my establishment. Yes, my dream is finally coming true. I don't know what to do. Okay, so it's nine, eight, three, two, nine, eight, three, two, blank, nine. Right? Where's the nine? Nine, right there. And what's this? I don't know what to do. Oh, I didn't know what to do. Maybe I gotta talk to these guys. We're lucky, it looks like someone took, it looks like she took someone else for now. You, you can still move. Take your chance while she's distracted with the other one. Don't look so grim, especially since you have a chance to escape. You're so fresh. You still have your wits about you. Among other things. Listen to me. Find Bonnie's note to save yourself. She's hidden the key code, but you can decipher it. You can escape through the door. Use WSD to move. <laughs> Those fresh legs of yours to sprint with shift. Don't let her see you. Don't let her hear you. If she sees you, come back here. Body's much kinder to the compliant ones. Mm, mm. Good night and good luck. Okay. All right. Well. He's right there. I hope Bonnie had a good day today. Don't look at me like that. You've never been down here during one of Bonnie's bad days? Am I about to get killed? I'm in a conversation, Bonnie! I gotta wait for her to go away because uh, if this conversation ends, then I feel a little scared. Her voice from up upstairs is always high-pitched and sweet. But we know when the bakery hasn't done too well, no one makes it out unscathed. Oh, alright. Bitch! Ah! Oh, she's coming in here. No! Ah! God damn it, Bonnie, you piece of shit! Oh, no, no. No, don't you do it! <laughs> you can't touch me! Mind your business, Bonnie! Ugly bastard! Really? Okay. Just a five digit code. Let's go! You escaped from Bonnie's Bakery. Finally free from that horrifying place. Nothing can erase those terrible smells and screams from your memories. Nothing you have to tell the townsfolk about Bonnie's parents. Oh, nothing. You have to tell the townsfolk about Bonnie's parents. Oops. Hmm, I don't know. That doesn't sound like something Bonnie would do. Yeah. Is this a prank or something? Man, thinking about that bakery is making me hungry again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> of course. The animals like eating each other. The townsfolk ignore your plea. No one believes you. 
and some even call you a liar. Ever since that day, you live in fear and paranoia. Even though you already moved away from that town, you always have an aching suspicion that someone is watching you. Any poor butt. Fear. Huh. Wow. I, I thoroughly enjoyed that. That was a good time. It was interesting. A little disturbing. It was it was fun. It was entertaining. I'd like to get some more of the, the endings. I think there's like four or six or five. I don't remember. But I'd like to get more of the endings. I just don't want the video to drag on too long. Maybe I'll come back to this game at some point. I believe on the games page, they said that they'd be releasing DLC at some point. So if you're the dev and you're watching, I, I think that's a brilliant idea. I think you have a nice little universe to expand on here. And I really do love the gameplay of this game. I love like the overcooked mixed with horror. Uh, overcooked, if none of you guys have seen or played it. An extremely fun, chaotic game. Play with your friends or even by yourself. But chaotic is like the first thing that comes in my mind when I think of overcooked. And it's kind of what I I felt here so i enjoyed mixing the two elements of that and horror and so i just think it was a really unique experience so to the dev bravo i think you created a nice little gem here and can't wait to see more from you guys um as for my viewers if you're still here come say hi in the comments i really appreciate you guys watching always love hearing from you guys please come say hi i promise i don't bite thank you guys for supporting me the channel has grown tremendously in the past like month month and a half and it's all thanks to your guys support so Thank you, thank you, thank you times a billion. That's all I'm going to say for this video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed. Please remember to stay safe out there. The world is absolutely crazy. Don't forget to stay positive, especially if you're going through anything. And most importantly, please remember to tell somebody you love them. I love you guys. I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.